hi guys welcome back to my channel how are you all doing today thank you so much for stopping by to watch today's video to my returning subscriber thank you so much for coming and if you are new here please don't forget to subscribe before you go and turn on your post notification so that anytime i post a new video you will not miss out okay so today we are going to be making a diy kinky crochet hair so i'm if you want to make your crochet hair, what you need is your stick, your barbecue stick, or your straw, or uh, and your your thread or your rubber band, and uh, of course your braiding extension hair. So I'm just going to sh take you guys step by step on how to achieve your cooking calling crochet hair so when you have your stick and your everything that you need you have to take your hair put it on your barbecue stick or your straw tie it around very well with your with your thread or your your babani one that you want to use when you tie it down that means you have already secured the extension or whatever you you may use the barbecue stick, stick or you use a straw whatever you can find so when you have that just put the 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 extension in the, in the stick and just start tie it down with that thread because if you want to use the rubber band you can also use the rubber band but i prefer to use the thread because it's cheaper and you can also use it next time so i will just use that to tie down the extension to the stick so that when i'm um road twisting it around the stick it will not pull out so that is the reason why you need to tie it down so i have many video on my many this kind of video like different type of crochet on my channel i will also leave that in the description box below or i will put it at the end screen so you can go and check it out so you can also learn to how to make other pattern other type of coil pattern crochet braiding hair so guys sorry about the noise so i'm just going to repeat the same process for you guys to see it very well this is going to be a kinking coiling crochet that is kinking that is the type of crochet that is very the coil is very thin it's not that kind of that have a very wide pattern of coil this is going to be like very tiny pattern of coils okay you can you can also use this for your uh, passion twist or your spring twist or you can also use it for your normal crochet just do whatever you want to do when you are done making this this um this crochet i will try i will also make a video on how i'm going to use this but i'm still thinking maybe i will use it to do a kicking twist or what i don't really know for now but i will make a video on that when i use it on my hair so i'm also going to repeat the same process in case you did not follow in case you did not follow you can also know what is going not right here please don't forget to subscribe give me thumbs up if you like this video give me a very huge thumbs up okay thank you thank you thank you thank you so much for <laughs> for the thumbs up and for subscribing and don't forget to click that bell that is the most important part of it when you subscribe you have to also put that bell in also that you will get all my notification when i upload a new video okay guys this is just what you need to do just start twisting it around the stick or your straw whatever you are using just be twisting it around you can see i'm very tired right here i have to rest myself in the <laughs> dining table because this is really tiring guys
okay guys now i'm done i have about 64 i have about 64 of this braid of this uh, crochet that i made so now i'm going I'm going to pour it inside this bowl and add some hot water that is going to help it to develop that coils So guys, this is my crochet hair. I've already started unraveling it off camera. So I'm just going to show you guys how it look like now. As you can see, how beautiful and that coils, guys. You can see that coil pattern. The way that is, this is what I was trying to explain to you earlier. So this is how the coil is going to be when you are done. So you can see how springy this is. You can use it for your spring twist. Like I said earlier, all your passion twist is going to work perfectly for you for that if you want to use it for that you can also use it for your spring your passion whatever or you just use it as a normal crochet okay <laughs> please don't, don't mind me so i'm just going to show you how you can carefully remove the crochet out of the stick just carefully just like so This is just another pattern of crochet that I also tried. So this is how the whole crochet hair is looking like. So beautiful and neat. So you can make your own crochet with just two hot two two arrow of um, a special braiding hair. You can make your own crochet hair. And so this is the one that I've already separate. Like I've already separated this one. So I'm just going to show you. Maybe if you want to use it for for your Passion twist, pink twist. I'm just going to show you how it's going to be like when you want to use it for that. I don't know what you might want to use it for. <laughs> so you can see before you make your your spring twist, you have to separate the coils very well. That is what I'm doing right here. As you can see, this is how it's going to be like when you, when you want to use it for your spring twist or passion twist. So I'm just trying to twist it around my hand for you guys to see <laughs> because I don't find it where I can where I can put it and twist it very well. So I just so I just decided to put it on my hand for you guys to see if you want to use it for your spring twist or passion twist, it's still going to work very well for that. 
so if you find this video helpful and not for you to subscribe and join my family please don't forget to to do that don't forget to also turn on the post notification so that you will not miss out of any of my new video thank you so much for watching this video to this extent i really appreciate you all thank you and i will see you all in my next one bye bye stay blessed and stay out of trouble